Hey guys, Herschel the rewards bro here. It's all about earning rewards daily, hey? So yeah, just dropping in with a, a quick video to add some content for the day and some learnings from the past weekend. So yeah guys, the past learning from the weekend was I minted some NFTs, IMX Punks, of Immutable X. So I thought I'd share this with you. You might not know what IMX is or Immutable X is. It's a layer two solution on the Ethereum network for trading NFTs. And I think it's pretty sweet because there's zero gas fees and just a small transaction fee. So if you've been trading Solana NFTs or Cardano NFTs, eight NFTs, you would know that the transaction fees are minimal. If you've been trading on OpenSea on the Ethereum network, man oh man, are those gas fees high. So this video is to share some learnings about my IMX trades and my IMX mints over the past weekend. So what is Immutable X? Immutable X is a layer 2 protocol for trading Ethereum NFT that gives users instant trades, huge scalability and zero gas fees without compromising ownership. It's a no-brainer to win. Gas fees are a killer. If you know what gas fees are, it's when you do trades on the Ethereum network and it's basically like a transaction fee. Um, and the higher the traffic, the greater the fee. And that happens on the Ethereum network. I pay gas fees up to about $260 uh, for an NFT set that I bought. And then I've also paid as low as $150. So it just depends on what's happening in terms of the market and volume and timing. However, gas fees are a schlep because imagine doing a trade of, let's say we use RANDs, 2,000 rand and your gas fees are hundred dollars. If you do that maths, it's like a thousand five hundred rand just for the gas fees. So in order for you to actually make money out of that trade, your money basically needs to be four X. So guys, IMX, huge solution, zero gas fees, small transaction fee, and literally it's a winner. So hence the video. So having a look at the website immutable.com. This will basically give you, give you more information about Immutable X as well as their marketplace for NFTs. Uh, you will see here, you will click on start trading and this will give you the full collection of... Okay, so this will give you the full collection of what NFT sets are currently on the IMX marketplace. Moody Crow is very well known and Astrobos, uh, these are some of the first uh, NFT sets on the IMX NFT marketplace and blockchain. So let's quickly have a look here. If we look at the low to high filter, you can see what the floor price is and it's 0.16. So there's been a good return for people who got in on mint on this. And I will do a separate video just kind of explaining how NFTs work in terms of whitelist, discord, minting, etc. But uh, what I wanted to show you is basically, I was quite keen on purchasing this guy. I would click on him, enjoy, like his features, check his rarity, etc, etc. But you'll see here it says you must be connected to Immutable X with your wallet to buy. So most important, you would click on connect wallet. You then need to go through a few steps, connect your Ethereum wallet, sign in with your Ethereum wallet, and then set up your Immutable X key. So you click connect wallet, and then it pushes through to MetaMask. So MetaMask is basically your off-chain or off-exchange wallet. So that's where you're going to be keeping, if you want to use MetaMask, you can. I use it. I remember this is for informational purposes and not for investment purposes, purely to educate you guys. So MetaMask, I use to store some of my cryptocurrency and you'll see that's my wallet address. And I'm connecting my IMX with my wallet. You need to do this in order to transact with IMX and Ethereum. So connecting my account, giving permission. Guys, always important, only sign requests if you've initiated the action with Mutable X. Reason for this is there's so many scams going out there. You need to be aware. Remember, information is power and knowledge is key. Sign in with your wallet. So a signature request will be sent and that's my wallet address. So let's sign in so we can connect and get going. So sign that and boom, Bob's your uncle, I'm connected. So insufficient funds deposit is to continue. Most important if you're buying off the secondary marketplace such as Immutable X, which is a comparable to OpenSea. OpenSea is on the Ethereum, um, but you pay major gas fees for that. And like I mentioned, IMX, the big benefit there is the fact that there's minimal to no gas fees, a very small transaction. So 
was ETH, so that's from my wallet on the main Ethereum network into my IMX section, IMX wallet. I will transfer into my IMX account 0.05 and I can click continue. I'm not going to do it, so I'm just showing you for informational purposes. If I wanted to purchase that NFT, that's the process. And Bob's your uncle, you just click accept. So what I'd like to show you next is Discord and how to mint and what I did on Saturday. So one of the biggest things you'll see in the NFT and crypto space is Discord is used majorly for communities and communication. Uh, this was something new to me until I really got into the NFT and the crypto space. This is where Discord and Twitter is where you get the really instant information very quick and fast and I've also got to learn that timing is everything and information is time sensitive so you could really miss out on either getting a whitelist or an early mint and probably 2xing your money so discord is your place to hang out and chat it's the easiest way to talk over voice video and text so if you haven't seen Discord before, this is pretty much what it looks like. Uh, you get an app for your computer and for your phone. You basically come in here and the different channels create servers. You'll see this. And in these servers, you'll see the various chats that go on. And this is the IMX punks. And I just wanted to quickly show you from the IMX, basically this server, you would safeguard yourself through clicking official links to mint. So if I quickly run through this, I'm going to do a separate video on Discord and how to manage your Discord. You'll see welcome announcements. This is all your information from your mods and your developers. And here's your general chat. And this is pretty much where you get key inside information from the community where you guys tell you things. You kind of get a vibe and a feeling for what's happening in that community. And something that happened with IMX Punks was there was a bit of a struggle with the whitelist mint, a um, bit of a delay. You know, these things kind of happen. As, and then it also happened on the public mint. I managed to get in, but the mods and developers have done really well to sort everyone out. And there was a bit of a delay on the server, but all good and all is well in the IMX village and hood. So basically, I wanted to quickly show you here. You would go to announcements and they would basically give you the developers and the mods would basically give you key information here on what's happened. You'll see here we officially sold out within minutes on the 19th of November. That was pretty cool. It was quite, uh, quite an intense mint. So if we go to mint info, this was all the info about the mint and the main sale. And then most important is to see the official links. So website, Twitter, Twitch, Immutable, and very exciting, IMX OpenSea coming soon. So if we click through to their website, this is more information about the project sometimes more information about the developers you'll see here basically on the day on the 19th what happened was you would click through to their website remember official links there's a lot of scams going out don't click on a incorrect link or a phishing link first punks on gas free eth so on the day of mint i quickly shot here clicked on to mint now you'll see mint imx punks and then basically what would have happened obviously the sale is done now it would have linked to your metamask wallet okay and you would have connected your metamask wallet with the imx punks main sale you would then have minted up to you could have chosen how many punks you wanted to mint i minted two uh, some guys minted three some guys minted five so yeah depending on um how many you could afford and how many you wanted to mint because you believe in the project and you would then have minted how many you wanted. Pretty cool, went through, like I said, 10 or I think 11, 10 or $11 was the transaction fee, pretty sweet. Gas fees are minimal and low. So yeah, that's pretty much as simple as that. I hope to do a live mint for you one day. I mean, you can kind of see the process on, on IMX. Um, but yeah, guys, I encourage you, play around, get to know Immutable X. It's a Ethereum, a layer two solution which has no gas fees so my question is why not that's all from me it's the rewards bro remember it's all about earning rewards daily keep on well.